Hi, this is Yolanda Van Veen, and in this segment, we're going to talk about how to smother a tick. Now, there's all types of information out there, and in the end, the best way to remove a tick from your body is with a tweezer or a special tick remover. Because whatever you're using to smother that tick, there's always a chance that the the part of it will end up inside of the wound and it can get infected. And in the end, ticks are very primeval bugs and they don't need a lot of oxygen. And whatever, whatever you try to smother them with, there's a chance that they will survive for quite a while and continue to eat into your skin. So it's best to take tweezers, any type of tweezers, and try to pull them out from the head and pull the entire tick out. Because whatever you're smothering with them with, in the end, they can still do damage. But you can still try to smother them. And the best way to smother them is with rubbing alcohol. So you just put rubbing alcohol on a cotton swab and just cover them with that. And make sure they're just covered. And that way the rubbing alcohol will break down their body and eventually they should die and they'll release. Another way to do it is Vaseline or oil or rubbing oil or any kind of olive oil. And you just cover them up. But the problem with that is apparently ticks can survive for quite a while without any oxygen. So even if you cover them up completely, they will still be eating into your skin. So even if you cover them up and trying to smother them, there's still a chance that they're going to continue to do damage. So going back to the best way is to use tweezers and actually pull them out. Other people swear to take a match, light the match, blow the match out, keep it really hot and actually burning them. And it scares them enough that they will come out but others swear that that's not good because they can actually do more damage because you're going to force them to fight their way into your skin even more. So in the end, protect yourself by putting oil on your body to start so that they won't bite you in the first place. And if you do get attacked by a tick, make sure and use any kind of a tweezer and try to pull it out completely. And you can try smothering it in a lot of different ways, whether it's with oil or rubbing alcohol or any other type of item that's actually going to stop them from breathing. Others say put them under water, put your whole hand underneath water and it, they won't get any oxygen. But others say they'll still do damage and it'll take a long time for them to die because like roaches, roaches can live in a ship underneath the ocean for more than a hundred years without any oxygen. So it's very difficult to smother them. So protect yourself to start and use the tweezers and only smother them as a last resort.